I've noticed um, when I'm searching out uh, to spot narcissists in public places, it's not it's not my sight that is the first thing uh, that I that I can identify them with. Uh, the first thing, the first, um, the first, the first thing is my ear, my ears, um, the way they talk, um, gives themselves away pretty quick. Um, usually they're the most annoying person in the, in the public place that you're in, uh, they usually um, have a bad attitude towards the service of the restaurant that they're in. If it's just a little slow, um, and they'll let the management know, you know, how disappointed they are in the service of how slow it is, and they'll walk out. You know, they'll storm out. You know, like the whole world is there to wait on them. You know. Um, and like they'll, 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 uh, it's just the way, the way they talk, uh, gives them away quicker than, uh, their, um, facial expressions or the way, or the, the way they're, you see them, you know, cause I, I can identify them like, like nothing just by, just by hearing, just by listening in any any public place that I'm in it's like it's almost like I'm hunting them without realizing that I'm hunting them <laughs> you know it's just like um it's just they they're they're pretty they're pretty they're a lot easier to spot based on just the way they they sound the way they talk for me my best, my best tool is my ears, my hearing, uh, and spotting them right away because they, they want the, they want the attention on them. They think they're the shit. They think they're God's gift to hum humanity. Uh, they think the whole world owes them everything, you know, and they're the, the king of the world, you know, in their own minds, you know, it's just, um, I don't know. It's just that it, that's what, and it doesn't matter. It doesn't, uh, matter about their age. You know, I've seen, uh, older people who you would think are more wise and more patient. And I've seen them be more bitchy than, uh, a teenager, you know, a teenager, um, uh, narcissist, you know, like it's not, it's not age, uh, discriminant, you know, I've noticed. Um, so yeah, like just the, just the, just the way they, just the, the way they talk for me is the, is the biggest giveaway that I noticed is just the way they talk, the way their attitude and how they talk. Um, just more than, more than what they look like from sight, you know? So just an observation that I've had in the past week or so, like I'm trying to, I'm trying to analyze every public place that I'm in, you know, a little more uh, keenly, you know, because uh, I want to spot them like before they even approach, you know, or even say anything to me or, you know what I mean? Or you get what I'm saying, but I'm just learning how to spot them quicker, you know just by the way they just by the way they talk how they talk what they talk about even the content of what they talk about uh when they're in a group setting and uh 
Anyways, just something I noticed, but I don't know. It's like it's like I'm I'm naturally becoming a hunter of the hunters or the predators. I'm I'm naturally becoming a, a hunter, like a hawk, hunting, like a a predator on the ground. You know, if that makes any sense. Like it's like I'm I'm like observing from above now. You know, instead of from below. You know, not instead of like a victim position, but more of a a, a hunter position. It's kind of crazy in a way but it's just something that happened naturally just sur just surviving these things you know just being around them um they they create they they created a monster without even them realizing it you know like i have all these uh, abilities you know survival instincts you know like I don't know, like, like Wolverine from X-Men, you know, like has these senses, you know, he can feel things out, he can hear things out, he can sniff things out, um, without, you know, it's like his body, his body knows, you know, it's like my body knows, uh, um, when that when you when I'm around these things you know it's like my body already knows when I'm around one of these uh bottom feeder predators and like I can shut I can shut my empathy off totally because of these being around them like just like they have no empathy towards me I can have no empathy towards them it's scary like <laughs> It's scary stuff because, like, I, I, I know that, like, um, if they were to try to attack me, like, I would finish them off probably and not feel anything. And that's scary. Like, I, I could finish them off if they attacked me. If they tried to attack me physically, I could finish them off and feel nothing. During that whole thing. And that's kind of scary. But that's that's what happens when you're around these kind of predators. You know, you get these kind of abilities to survive, you know. But, I don't know. It's not something I really asked for. It's just something that kind of happened, you know. But, anyways. So, yeah, I feel like I'm... I'm becoming a hunter of these things, you know, without me even trying, you know, like any, anytime I go into a store of any kind, you know, I'm analyzing the room, analyzing, uh, the uh, individuals I, I walk by, I listen, uh, you know. I, I I evaluate the I evaluate and discern the room for predators, you know, right off the bat. You know, like I want to identify them like right off the bat, and uh, so um, so I'm more on the offensive and uh, not so much as an easy target for them to approach and start their whole uh, con. <laughs> their 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 whole uh try to hook you hook you in illusion you know anyways just something i wanted to, to talk about because it's just something i noticed is that uh i can identify them with my ears faster than i can with my eyes and that's pretty crazy anyways I'll talk to you later.